Climate change is real. Because we care. A massive wake-up call. Huge extremes in dry and wet seasons are putting our food systems at risk. In such uncertainties, losses farmers face and variability in produce are inevitable. So how do we minimize these losses, proactively deal with these variabilities, and prepare the world for an increase in these trends? In this episode, we find answers to these questions. When we look at the supply chain of agriculture in India, we see that there are a lot of gaps when it comes to quality from farm to folk. In these gaps, we see that lack of quality instrumentation is the biggest kind of problem that is being faced. Our objective is to reduce this wastage also as a side benefit of ensuring quality in the supply chain. Of course, once the produce is far enough in the supply chain, it cannot be redirected. The entire produce is thrown away and it goes to complete waste. That is like, you know, where we as RAV step in. We have two flagship products. Uh, one is Aonir that is capable of detecting both the internal and the external defects or the, the parameters as we say inside fruits and vegetables. We have Nirspect which is capable of identifying you know, uh, the adulteration, nutrition, taste and even the shelf life of you know, commodities. So when we look at the solutions that are available today, right, they are very expensive, they are very tedious, they are difficult to use, basically meant for labs. The technology behind which our devices are based on is uh, called Near Infrared Spectroscopy along with Machine Vision. We have designed devices that are portable, that are cost effective and are eco-friendly that way. It can enable you to test array of commodities in less than 5 seconds. When it comes to sorting, it enables them to make rapid decisions. Today, as a proof of concept, RAV successfully works with the largest agri-commodity buyer in India and many other conglomerates. But eventually we want to get to the farmer, make it more affordable, cover a larger array of commodities so that we are able to present a solution which is beneficial to all, all people involved in the supply chain. Our next innovation, Raheja Solar, helps farmers handle imperfect produce during periods of high market volatility. Indian farmers are losing one third of their total production every year. When you compare with other Southeast Asian countries, almost 60 to 70 percent of their total production is getting processed. When you compare with India, just 5% is getting processed. Indian farmers, they don't have any other option just to throw it away. I am Shubham Patel, Jila Khandwa Gram, Kodi Gol. We have the biggest problem with farmers is that you take the farm in the field, but the farm will not get the right amount of money in the field. That's where we come into the picture to help them value their product when the markets are not good. To do so, we designed a most affordable and DIY foldable solar dryer. Solar dry is a system which uses sun energy to dehydrate the product without losing the natural color, taste, fragrance and nutrition. And it can help to preserve the product for more than a year without using any preservative or chemical. And it is very easy to use it. You have to open it, you have to take a tray from it and you have to cut it and you have to dry it in the sun. In the beginning, we didn't get the sun to dry it in the beginning. उसके लिए हमें मार्केट नहीं मिल रहा था कि हम उसे किस तरीके से बेच जाए जाए क्योंकि मंडियों में आप फ्रेश प्याज को ले जाओ तो आपके पास कभी भी व्यापारी मिल जाते हैं आपका माल खरीद लेते हैं पर सूखे उत्पाद का एक अलग ही मार्केट होता है। We are creating a centralized market for them where we buy back their produce and pay them upfront. That's where Raja Solar is creating an ecosystem where farmers can earn a better income, where we promote social entrepreneurship and reduce their post-harvest losses and provide a better livelihood. Let's work together to make our farmers independent. We at Wilgro take pride in nurturing innovations that are sustainable, scalable and attend to pressing community needs. The world needs more of such social innovations. And the future of social innovation starts with inventing right, inventing for impact. <laughs>